YouTube, it's Christopher. Boy, do I got an awesome one for you today. This I'm very excited to show you. This is a Vola OZ uh, RV TNC. Very catchy name. This thing is unbelievably beautiful. It's a Vola. So good. Painted headstock. We got a bone nut, I think. I can't remember. Was it a bone nut? Oh, it doesn't look like it says, but I think it is. Sorry, I should have uh, studied this better. This is a uh, chambered mahogany body with a full thickness maple top. You can see how thick the top is there. Clear pick guard. You got a HSH config. This is a humbucker in the neck. It's got a Goto 510 for a bridge. Absolutely stunning instrument. It's got a one piece roasted maple neck, stainless steel medium jumbo frets, locking Goto tuners, skunk stripe in the back, four bolt, no plate. This thing is gorgeous absolutely gorgeous so I have a review on my channel of my buddy Adams Vola he had their telly style I can't remember the the name of the model I think it's called a Vasti or a Vesti or something like that I love the little cutout here this thing is beautiful 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 I bought this literally two days ago and here it is, two days later at my house. Huge shout out to uh, John at, um, God, what is the name of the company? Killer Burst Guitars in Connecticut. He was kind enough to send out photos of the setup and the settings. Uh, this thing is perfect. I don't have to do anything to this setup wise absolutely glorious right out of the box this came in a beautiful fitted vola uh, hard shell case this is a stunning stunning instrument let me explain very quickly what the wiring is in here so each of these pots you go a single volume and a single tone are push-pull so when the volume pot is pulled it enables the neck pickup. So no matter where you are on the switch, if you push this up, boom, your neck comes on. So that gives you an additional two tones in your standard positions. So as well as the, you, the five position switch that you get, when you're in position two uh, and position one, with this popped up, you have this and this in the one position. And then here you have all three, which is very, very cool. Now, aside from just that, this one pushes, or, or pulls, I should say, and when you do that, it splits both humbuckers. So now, you have single coils here and here. And, <laughs> so now, not only does that give you, how many more, one, two, three, four more tones there. <laughs> if you pull this out, it gives you an additional one and two, an additional six, so eight, so you have 13 tones that you can get out of this guitar, which is pretty impressive. Now on top of all that, there's a button right here. And when you press this button in, these pickups bypass the, the volume knob and the tone knob and go directly to the output. And what that does is, you know, when you have wiring in the channel or in the path for the electricity to go through or the electronics to flow, whatever you want to say, uh, there's a bit of impedance that's added and what that does is it's a little tiny reduction of signal but when you bypass that and the signal goes directly out to your cable it gives you a little bit more it just gives you a little top end boost and it just it, it gives you a, a louder signal which I'll try to demonstrate later whether or not you'll hear it through the YouTube compression I have no idea God looking at that finish is so beautiful this is called a light tiger eye burst finish. 
and my god I could just stare at it all day which I have <laughs> um, but man it's gorgeous so let's go through the tones I'm gonna start out as usual on my clean channel here and of course I'm using the archetype Petrucci from Neural DSP so here's some clean tones on the full bridge humbucker <clears throat> Goto bridge is set up to float right now, so I got a little bit of up pull on it. So I can get my awesome little vibrato that I like so much. It's a bridge pickup. Here's the second position, which is the bridge in the middle. Ooh, spank. to the bridge and then I'm gonna pop this up and give me the neck in as well so, neck so now it's the full bridge humbucker and the neck humbucker so you got these two <laughs> second position it's all three pickups to the middle position. fourth position which is the middle and the neck position. Beautiful. So now I'm going to go back and I'm going to put the splits. So I pop that up and now my humbuckers are split. So I'll go through the tones of those split positions. This is just the bridge split. And 
And now here's the split bridge and the split neck. <laughs> Second position now is the split bridge, the middle, and the split neck. So all three, but with the humbucker split. So that's really cool, man. You got the split positions with the neck, all three pickups, that's amazing. So now here's the fourth position, which will be in the split mode, uh, the middle and the split neck. <laughs> Neck position, split. Beautiful clean tones, man. That's really gorgeous. So I'm going to step up the gain a little bit here. I'm going to go to my mutton chops patch. This has a kind of a classic rock tone. Here's the bridge pickup. <laughs> Perfect tone for that. Here's that bridge pickup split. Let's turn the gate off, see how much hum we get on that thing, but it sounds pretty quiet. Tiniest bit of hum. That's pretty awesome. Now here's with the neck split added in. with the bridge split. Did I already do that? I did. So let's go to the second position, which is now the bridge split and the middle. not split in the middle. Here's the 
here's the middle position. <laughs> Middle and neck. forgotten in position two to get all three pickups split <laughs> Let's see what it sounds like under some high gain here. We'll go load up our majestic boom. Here we go. Bridge pickup. <laughs> Bridge pickup is called a Vola Flame Bucker 2, and Flame Bucker is an appropriate name for that thing. It sounds mighty. <laughs> added both split with the neck not split or sorry with both pickups not split so it's full humbucker full humbucker <laughs> Uh, 
pole position. Get an awesome twang out of that. Here's the fourth position. Fourth with the split neck. split. Damn, this thing is nuts. Oh man, I got the blower switch on. So, <laughs> so let's see if you can hear the difference. So here's the humbucker. Now with the blower switch on. Yeah, you can hear that there's higher uh, high mids and highs. Yeah, for sure. You can tell when this is engaged. Right now it's not. And now it is. It cuts a little bit more. That's pretty awesome. So there you have it. This is the Vola Oz. Uh, what is it again? RVTNC. Uh, and it is stunningly beautiful. And again, huge shout out to John over at... Um, <laughs> I cannot remember every single time I go to say it. Killer Burst Guitars in Connecticut. Super, super, super cool dude. He sent over photos of the setup. He sent over photos of the guitar and uh, showed me how it looked in the case right prior to shipping. Uh, very, very cool guy over there. I looked at his store online and his stock is crazy. Uh, so if you're ever in that area in Connecticut, I highly recommend visiting that store and checking it out online as well. Uh, he's got a lot of cool things there, man, and he's a he's an authorized Vola dealer, uh, which is really cool. How this brand is not a household name, I do not know, because these guitars are fantastic. Um, worth every penny. Absolutely gorgeous, stunning instrument. If you have an opportunity to try one of these things, don't hesitate. This immediately jumped to the top of the food chain in my collection. Uh, quite a gorgeous guitar. Sounds amazing. The versatility is just above anything else I own. And that top is sick. And it's just gorgeous. Check them out, Vola Guitars, if you haven't. They're amazing. And uh, definitely go check out uh, Killer Burst guitars online or in person because uh, it is a brick and mortar store and uh, thank you very much john for your help with sending this out as quickly as you did and uh making it a very very pleasant purchase so uh yeah there you go vola 
Oz. Things insane. See you guys in the next one. Peace.